My driving philosophy is to provide a role model uh, you know, by showing that passion that I have for accounting, I know that you know, if I show that passion for the, for the subject, uh, that is something that the, the students will develop as well. Java is extremely student-centric in his teaching by providing a caring and enabling learning environments to students where students feel motivated to learn and achieve even when they are at different points of readiness. Java is very experienced and patient. You know what the students tell us about him? They love his sense of humor. Very fun, very realistic, engaging, best teacher. When I started this uh, module teaching, a law student uh, gave me the feedback that this subject is uh, boring, this subject is very dry, very theoretical. At the end, when they do the evaluation, a lot of them actually say that uh, I actually open up their mind about this subject. They are more receptive, they are more open to try to want to go into this area of practice. Chikong is a very experienced lecturer in taking care of students with this kind of background. Many of his students choose to follow in his footsteps and move on to an audit firms to start their career as an auditor. Mr. Fang Chi Kiong started teaching at SIM a long time ago in the 1990s and he was one of our anchor accounting lecturers. Well done, Chi Kiong. Congratulations on getting your Teaching Excellence Award. I think my passion for teaching goes beyond imparting technical knowledge to encompass life skills. To learn how to learn is as much, if not more important than what they stand to learn. Ayat uses her teaching and real world experience to demonstrate alignment with various course learning outcomes for the courses that she teaches into, including demonstrating the relationship between creativity, design, innovation thinking, and their practical impact on business, as well as demonstrating the continued development of critical thinking skills and ensuring that graduates are work ready. I have been teaching for more than 20 years. I think I'm one who wants to teach not just the concepts and facts to my students, I want to teach my students how to react as well as to respond. So I'm thankful for this award to help me to set my anchor correct again. Claire is a very valued um, teacher. Her whole um, mindset is about how can I help the students learn and how can I help the students understand the materials to the best of my abilities. Those are uh, the things that inspire me, um, that she's a good teacher. I believe that my passion for teaching will give a positive environment for my students to learn from. I know that my students can feel the vibes that lecturers bring into the lecture hall and uh, having a positive and cheerful uh, disposition uh, would help my students learn better. Grace is a very caring lecturer. She really concerns about the students' academic performance and because of that, she's always willing to go to the extra mile to guide the students. And that, in fact, is what really makes her a good lecturer. What I like best about teaching is the ability to bring the subject alive. To me, 
the best practice would be putting yourself in the shoes of the student. So it's not so much of the content anymore, it's about making the subject connect with them. Ek has been involved in the Bachelor of Psychological Science program for a number of years now. He's a very committed staff member and very dedicated to his discipline. The students find him engaging and very supportive. He's an outstanding teacher. For teaching, the most important thing is about students' learning. So the students can learn best if they are given time to think about what they have just learned and ask questions. Cleo's strengths are her enthusiasm and her open-mindedness. She's very, very encouraging about helping students to develop their critical thinking skills in analyzing a work of art and then making plausible arguments about it using the established terminology and vocabulary for the art history discipline. 